Hi, my name is Jay Simmons. I'm the founder and president of Mach 30, a nonprofit dedicated to developing open source spaceflight hardware. We're also the ones behind Open Design Engine, recently funded through the Kickstarter Open Hardware Needs a Source Forge of its own. First, I want to thank everyone who has uh, retweeted us, who's supported us financially, or asked us questions, uh, or left comments on Google+, Twitter, or the Kickstarter itself. Thank you very much all for your support. I have a few notes here that I uh, want to go over real quick as a quick update. First of all, a little bit of history. Open Design Engine started about a year ago when we started developing requirements in cooperation with CSTART, another open source spaceflight organization, and having conversations with uh, several folks that we know in our network of open source hardware advocates. After developing the requirements, we partnered with Little Lines, a Ruby on Rails firm here in Dayton, Ohio, to develop a private alpha to showcase the core features of Open Design Engine. Those features are based upon Redmine, an established open source Ruby on Rails project management portal tool. And now we have uh, moved past that into the fundraising for the public beta, our kicks, which we did through Kickstarter. The Kickstarter was successful. It was very exciting when we first saw our uh, pledges top $6,000, our project goal. We ended up closing at $6,237 out of our $6,000 goal and had 166 backers. Uh, to us, that's still a staggering number of people to offer support. Thank you very much, one and all. We have uh, collected the pledges from all but one backer with a total of $5,713 raised after uh, paying for the Kickstarter and Amazon fees. <clears throat> What's next for Open Design Engine? Well, we've started uh, sending out the surveys to our backers to get all the information necessary to offer the rewards. In particular, we're focusing on the $25 and above levels so that we can get accounts turned on this week for our backers. Be looking for account registration emails if you're at that pledge level or above. We will also uh, start working with Little Lines uh, in the next couple weeks to get rolling on the first of the features that will be part of the public beta. Those features include adding support for Git so that new projects can host on either can host source code in either Subversion or Git. A couple of user administration features, including a, a tool to allow users to stay up to date on the terms of service on the site, and to consistently register their projects as open source software and hardware. Lastly, we're going to enable uh, users to post their Kickstarter, Pledgy, and PayPal uh, account buttons on their wiki pages for their projects so that they can uh, raise funds and sell their uh, hardware kits through Open Design Engine. Again, thank you everyone that's participated in the Open Design Engine Kickstarter. We couldn't have done this without you. Lastly, stay uh, to stay up to date, be sure to keep uh, an eye on the Kickstarter Updates tab for Open hardware needs a source forge of its own, as well as OpenDesignEngine.net itself. Thank you again. Have a great day.